All right, this is a Kindle iPad tablet stand. It was pretty easy to put together. If you're not careful and you lift it right here, I'm lifting it just fine, but it will, it will come apart right there. It's meant to be lifted at the bottom. We've had a few of these. We've had ones that have had different kinds of neck features. This seems more durable, more long lasting. We've had this several months. It'll hold smaller things. This is a small Amazon on fire tablet or it will hold bigger items. It holds them well. The thing we like best about this, this, this foot has to be facing whatever way your arm is, but this can go out really far if you're trying to put it under a bed for someone who wants to be able to watch their stuff from bed we like it most because of how far it goes out we've not had issues with it like slowly falling down like some things do it stays where it needs to be these can be tightened and it does not move on you it stays wherever you put it sometimes it feels a little unstable like i said we've not had it fall they do say that you can go ahead and put something on the bottom. You can put like five pound weight or two pound weight on the bottom base of it if you want to make it more sturdy. We haven't seen the need to do that, but if it just makes you nervous, if it feels too wobbly, you could do that. We've used a lot of different Kindle stands for my daughter. And like I said, this one reaches the furthest over the bed and stays in place where we put it the best. So we would recommend it. If you'd like to purchase it, there's a link in the description. We get a small commission and it would really help us out. I'm Chris and with my wife Abby's help, I'm on a quest to review literally everything sold on Amazon. So if there's something that you need a review of, literally just tell me, let me know in a comment and I'll literally buy it and just review it for you, literally. They tell me that I'm never gonna make it. They want me to do something that can make sense.